Okay, so I am going to now explain to you how to rename your files. I'm in the library panel of Lightroom and um, um, and so I, let's backtrack. So over here you want to make sure you have your file structure set up. So I had recommended Art145. Know where it is. Mine's on my pictures in my picture folder on my computer. Um, I have a subfolder photo assignments and right now I have assignments A1 through 3. You should re put go all the way to 7 and do that in Finder or um, on your desktop if you have a PC. Okay, so we're doing line shape, pattern and color. Uh, here we are in the middle panel and you can see I have these images and names and numbers but uh, MG it actually signifies that these were shot in um, in RAW Adobe RGB but we're going to make this more meaningful so you're going to select all these images command A is the shortcut but if you don't remember the shortcut which I would like you to do because it just makes the workflow quicker. You could go to edit, select all, and it's going to tell you the command is command A and on a PC it'll be control A. Okay, so I've selected all these images and, um, and they're highlighted. So now the assignment was for 50. I have 33, but this is just for um, demonstration always shoot more than less so now I'm going to go into my library menu not the library module two different two different places I am in the library module and then I'm going to library menu has many choices we're going to go to rename photos and then I'll, this another menu opens up and it'll open up from where you last were at. So if you don't see the screen, just click on whatever is coming up. It probably, I don't know, doesn't matter. Um, I think the easiest thing to do is go to edit. And I'm gonna just erase all this stuff. So right now, by the way, CR2, that's a raw extension for some Canon cameras. So the, um, the protocol for our class is your initials, and you can do upper caps or lower caps. I like upper, so I'm doing CMD. That's my initials. Don't use my initials. Use your initials. Then underscore, and then you put the assignment number. So this is assignment 2, A2. And another rule of thumb or tip is to keep your files meaningful and, and as short as possible. So we're not going to say line, shape, pattern, color. We know that that's assignment two. And then I'm going to put another underscore. And then I'm going to go to these choices here. And I'm going to put in sequence. And just let me show you, there's lots of choices in sequence. But I'm going to say insert, and it's now it's there. So you double check, it says CMD, my initials, underscore assignment two, underscore the number. So I'm gonna say done. And then it's gonna show you here again, check one more time, say okay. And it's going to rename all these um, beautifully. And, um, and you can notice that I have lots of um, keywords. So I'm going to stop this video now and um, practice doing that, and um, thanks for listening.